Good day everyone! So ngayon ay pag-uusapan natin ang tungkol sa RPMS 2023-2024. Ano-ano yung mga MOVs na gagamitin dito. Without further ado, let's start! Okay, so good day everyone. So pag-uusapan natin ngayon ang mga MOVs na gagamitin sa ating RPMS. Uunahin natin yung KRA 1, Objective 1. Applied Knowledge of Content Within and Across Curriculum Teaching Areas. Ano-ano yung mga MOVs na gagamitin dito? Una, uh, it will be observed from first to fourth quarter. So, ang gagamitin na MOVs ay uh, from first quarter to fourth quarter. Bali, apat na apat na COT yung gagamitin dito. Uh, about sa applied knowledge of content within and across curriculum. So, dapat kung uh, ilagay ninyo ang inyong MOVs dito is i-highlight ninyo yung number one. So, i-highlight ninyo. Depende na sa inyo kung ano yung highlighter na, in, na inyong gagamitin. And sa objective 2 na naman is use a range of teaching strategies that enhance learner achievement in literacy and numeracy skills. So, ang MOVs na gagamitin, ganun pa rin yung COT or yung Classroom Observation Tool. It will be observed from first to fourth quarter. So, apat na COT ang gagamitin. So, pwede naman na ang gagamitin, yung ginamit ninyo sa uh, KRA, KRA 1, Objective 1, ganun pa rin yung gagamitin ninyo sa Objective 2, pero ang i-highlight ninyo is yung number 2. And, next is, so, sa KRA 1, Objective 3, Applied a range of teaching strategies to develop critical and creative thinking as well as other higher order thinking skills. Ganun pa rin ang gagamitin. Uh, first to fourth quarter COT. So, ang gagamitin dito is first to fourth quarter COT. Uh, ganun, pwede pa rin gamitin yung ginamit ninyo. I-photocopy lang, pero ang i-highlight ninyo is yung number 3. No? So, hindi naman siya masyadong uh, mahirap kasi balik-balik lang naman. At saka, i-highlight na din ninyo yung number 3. Sa KRA 1, Objective 4, applied a range of teaching strategies to develop critical and creative thinking as well as other higher order thinking skills. Ang MOV sa gagamitin ay COT pa rin, Classroom Observation Tool na ginamit ng inyong school head, principal, na nag-observe sa inyo. Uh, ang ang i-attach natin is first and third quarter only. Yung COT ninyo, isa sa first quarter at saka isa sa third quarter. Ngayon is pupunta naman tayo sa KRA2, Objective 5. Establish safe and secure learning environments to enhance learning through the consist consistent implementation of policies, guidelines, and procedures. Ano-anong MOVs ang gagamitin dito? Uh, COT pa rin na it will be observed from first and third quarter only. I-highlight ninyo yung number 5. No? Isa sa first quarter and isa sa third quarter. KRA 2, Objective 6. Maintain learning environments that promote fairness, respect, and care to encourage learning. So, ano-ano ang, MO, ang MOVs na gagamitin? COT pa rin. It will be observed from first and third quarter. Isa sa first quarter at saka isa sa third quarter. Huwag kalimutan, i-highlight ang number 6. 
Hey, R E two. Objective seven. Establish a learner-centered culture by using teaching strategies that responds to their linguistic, cultural, socio-economic, and religious background. Uh, what are the MOBs that we are going to use? It will be observed from second and fourth quarter only. So, isa sa second quarter na COT ninyo, classroom observation tool, and isa sa fourth quarter. Dalawa lang po. Second at saka fourth quarter. Paki-highlight na lang po ang number seven. KRE2, Objective 8. Adapt and use cultural appropriate teaching strategies to address the needs of learners from indigenous groups. Ano-ano ang MOBs na gagamitin? Ganun pa rin, COT. No? Uh, it will be observed from second and fourth quarter only. Dalawa lamang po, second and fourth quarter only. And now we are in KRA3, Objective 9. Set achievable and appropriate learning outcomes that are aligned with learning competencies. Ano-ano ang MOBs na pwedeng gamitin dito? Ang MOBs na gagamitin dito ay one of the following supporting MOBs. So, isang sa nakastate dito, kung magkikita ninyo dyan sa screen, merong DLM, lecture or discussion, activity or activity sheet, performance task, rubric for assessing, performance using criteria that appropriately describe the target output. So, isa dyan, ang, pwede kayong pumili kung ano ang inyong i-attach na MOBs. Okay. So, one attachment, two points. Two attachment, three points. Three attachment, four points. And four attachment, five points. One every quarter. Kung halimbawa, ang pipiliin mo po ay DLM, kailangan po siya one every quarter. So, isang DLM sa first quarter, isa sa second quarter, isa sa third quarter. So, mayroon kang five points. So, halimbawa, kung DLM yung sa first attachment mo, sa uh, first quarter, sa second quarter is iba naman, at least, at least meron kang uh, four attachment, no? Sa kada quarter. So, apat lahat. Sa KRA3 naman, objective 10, use strategies for providing timely, accurate, and constructive feedback to improve learner performance. Objective, objective 5 will be observed from second and fourth quarter only. Ano ang MOB sa gagamitin? COT. So, classroom observation tool pa rin ang gagamitin. Second and fourth quarter only. Dalawa lamang po. KRA 3, objective 11. Utilize assessment data to inform the modification of teaching and learning practices and programs. Uh, ano ang MOVs na i-attach? One of the following supporting MOVs. Uh, pwedeng intervention material, lesson plan, reading camp, or field iri. One of the following. So, isa. Pumili ka ng isa dyan. It, one attachment, two points, two attachments, and three points, and three attachment, four points, and four attachment, five points. One every quarter. Isa kada quarter. So, pumili ka lang dyan kung ano yung i-attach mo every quarter. Kung gusto mo lesson plan, one to fourth quarter, okay lang. Basta isa-isa kada quarter. Kung isa sa first quarter is intervention material, uh, sa second quarter is lesson plan, so pwede. Basta mayroon kang apat na attachment.